Namaste. During the first week of lockdown, I felt really despondent and low spirited. Even though people think it it's easier to study at home as it is more comfortable, whereas we have to work twice as hard as we work usually. Online lectures are being conducted, assignments are being given, tests are being taken regularly. So it's not really quarantine for us. We are feeling both sad during this. of what I did. Always had a keen interest in cooking and for that I joined the gourmet club in my school. But due to studies I gave it less of attention but now I got this time and made some new appetizing dishes. I really like doing makeup so I thought why not try some looks. I really did something productive. I learned stitching, sketching, I learned origami art and I learned something to cook really tasty like some continental dishes. Here is a poem I wrote on coronavirus. In this world filled with disasters right now, we're currently in the making of history with how, from fighter planes to soldiers in rains, wars before were always fought by deadly arms and whatnot. But here we are in a race against time where every move may be even worse or fine. Some people take caution while some don't even care. And today we're told not to share this. Quarantine taught me to do yoga and as you have to study from dawn till dusk and you cannot go out either so you need something to just relax your mind so yes yoga is the thing that I do I meditate so that you know I just get a time with myself and relax for a while During the home quarantine I am spending my time with my grandparents I passed my mostly time watching videos on an academy day and learning new things. I witnessed the beautiful sunrise. From my rooftop where I used to play with my sisters a few years ago. For reasons unknown, it filled me with hope. The reddish yellow sky gave me hope that just like the night has gone and the day has taken over, so shall we get over this pandemic and life shall bloom and prosper once again. It is very easy to tackle the situation by taking some preventive measures such as practicing respiratory hygiene and trying to enhance your immunity. I suggest you all that you can pursue your interest in online courses that are offered free during this crisis. Also, do you know Amazon is offering free online audible stories for children so that they can learn new things during these days. And we request you all to stay home, stay, stay safe, safe and pray for the corona fighters. Seeing all this destruction raises questions in my mind. But together we can and together we will finish off this enemy in no time. So, stay home, stay healthy, ease your mind, spread positivity and hashtag go corona.